I walked a long distance here, so now I demand to be fed. <laughs> Uh, yo guys, so I was walking around Westlands, you know, and uh, I've seen also this, uh, you know, this place where they're selling smokies. You know, so you can see like inside they have smokies and on the other side you will see like some eggs. I don't know if you guys can see clearly, you know, like you can see the eggs inside there. You know, and also you guys, I told you like kachumbari is everywhere, you know, kachumbari is like kachumbari goes with anything, you know. And uh, as you can see up here we have like some kachumbaris, you know. Uh, the, that's the ketchup, you know. The ketchup is so important; it makes the it, it makes it most delicious, you know. Also, if you guys have noticed, you know, you will sometimes see bread, you know, because the bread they take the bread and uh, they put the. Yeah, man. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take one one egg, you know. I mean, as you can see, like he's heating the eggs, uh, you know, opening the eggs so that you know. It can be easier to put the kachumbari and the tomato sauce inside. Like you guys, it's like it's it's a very nice technique that is using there to remove the shells, as you can see. So he's adding the he's adding the the kachumbari, and that's the salt right there. That's the salt. Yeah, man, and some pepper, you know. Like pepper makes the food even more delicious, you know. Yeah, man, so as you can see, it's almost ready. So finally, guys, this is the eggs, you know. This is the eggs right here. You know, this is the egg right here. It looks so nice, so delicious, you know. And I just want to eat this and tell you guys how it tastes like, you know. Mm. Man, I can feel the pepper, you know. Like the pepper is just too much, you know, just too much, you know. Like I feel like my eyes is burning right now. But if you love pepper, you know, then I'm sure that you, you're gonna love this, you know, this food right here, you know, this nightlife street food in Westlands. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so guys, so she she's gonna teach us how <laughs> she, you know, she how she eats her ugali. So, fresh peas, yeah? You take it from the top and you pinch it off between the fingers. And then you have to, like, I don't know, you press it into a ball. And then you can see it started to become like, I don't know if you can see on camera, but it becomes like smoother the, when you when you need it in your fingers. And then you, if you're having it with soup, you make a little dent and then you just scoop up what you want to eat. <laughs> and then there you have it. It's an edible spoon. I mean, so you guys will see her technique is very, very nice. You know, that's the real African technique, you know, the real Kenyan technique, you know. I mean, so like, uh, do you have anything to tell to the audience out there, people who are watching, especially uh, to, uh, from the US? Who love to come to travel to Kenya? You know, also taste these delicious African foods. You know. Mm. Mm. I think what I would tell people is, Kenya is one of those places. No matter what, even if you, you'll either fall in love with it and you'll decide you want to move here, or you will still be happy that you came because it's an easy place to travel to. It's an easy place to find something to do. Like even though I've been here for ten years. I know there's always somewhere to go in Kenya and I've never met a Kenyan that doesn't like traveling and especially if you're from abroad you can have a very nice time in Kenya there's always going to be somewhere for you to go and Kenya is very welcoming so guys our chapati is ready like it looks so delicious you know so fresh you know yeah but so Calvin's like are you ready for this Man, I'm just taking a bite right now and the party is just amazing, man. I just like it plus the maragwe. I can't wait to, you know, finish all this. It's all about supporting local business, you know. So if you want to join us in eating this amazing and delicious food, uh, just subscribe and, and turn on that beautiful notification bell.
Uh, so guys, like the food is very, very delicious. And I hope my brother here, the Calvin's family, is also enjoying the, you know, the, the delicious food, the chapati and the beans, man. I, brother, are you, are you loving it? This is the best meal ever, man. I, I just really like, especially, you know, the, green, the greens part of it is just making it so, so much delicious that, you know, I'm just, um, I mean, the chapati itself is also just very, very much nice. It's so much soft. And I just like how these people from this hotel make it. Yo, brother, like you live around here, man. Like you should be coming here and support uh, and support the local, you know, local food here. You know, uh, like I, I really love the food. It's very, very delicious, man. You know, to be honest, okay, um, I've been seeing this hotel over here, but I haven't found the opportunity to get inside. To, to, so today is my first time in this hotel, and I'm just amazed because the kind of food they make, guys, is just super, super nice. And you know, next time, bro, I'll be coming here to film a video for myself. And so guys, like I was looking around here and I saw this amazing Volkswagen, you know, like a old school Volkswagen, man. Like it looks so amazing, man. Yeah, so guys, I was walking around Langata. I'm right here at Freedom Heights Mall and I saw this guy selling some mutura. Like people really love eating mutura here in Nairobi, Kenya, man. Like if you come to Kenya, you have to try mutura. It's also delicious. You can get it at 10 bob, uh, 20 shillings, 50 shillings, any amount you want. Um, like it's so delicious. So I, I am buying for 20 shillings. You know, it's all about supporting uh, local businessmen and women. So I am, I'm buying uh, for, for 20 shillings. So guys, this is the mutura right here. It's so delicious, you know. This is the cow cow's intestine. And also, if you love like kachumbari, like it's provided kachumbari, pepe, chili, you know. Uh, so like it makes the food the the, nyama, the not the nyamachoma. Oh my goodness, uh, the <laughs> uh, the mutura and the meat very very delicious. Like it's very very delicious man and also the chili it, it makes it even more delicious so when you're living in langata around freedom heights mall you know when you see this guy selling right here you know selling the uh, muturan the meat make sure you to support a brother a kenyan brother a local business and buy his uh his uh, mutura yeah man mutura very delicious indeed yeah very very delicious man people love it here in kenya Yo, my brother, thank you so much for the mutura. Welcome. A shout out to all uh, people who are coming from Langata, man. Like, I, I really love your matatus and, and I'm really enjoying myself here in Langata. And, and if you're still enjoying this video, man, support your brother, Elvis Derry, the king of YouTubers. And you know how we do it. It's all about content after content. Yo guys, like this nyamachoma and the kachumari, like it looks so delicious, man. Like I can't wait to have a bite. You can see how it's cooked, you know. You can see the onions right there. Also the meat right there. Like it smells very nice too. Yeah, man. So like uh, I wish I had my ugali right here, but unfortunately today there's no ugali. So I'm going to take it like this, you know. So the moment of truth is here, you know. So you want to taste the nyamachoma. You oh, can yay. see there. Yeah, so Maggie, are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah. And you should taste the first one. Yeah, like man. How, mm. guys, how is that nyamachoma? Mm. Yo, like it's so soft, very soft. And tender. And also, like it's so juicy, man. Like you can feel the juice. And, and like it's so delicious, man. And guys, mm. um... Let me, let me give you some. Mm. There's something unique about this nyamachoma. This guy put um, 
Onions. Onions. Like yeah. it, I've never seen this before. Mm -hmm. So this makes it uh, more delicious. <laughs> I walked a long distance here, so now I demand to be fed. Shang <laughs> <laughs>